Hello, my friend. Last time, I showed you how to use Hibernate XML config file to do the OR mapping. This time, we are going to use CPA annotations to do the same work. OK, let's start it. Let's first uh, go over what we did last time. We first create uh, an entity class called cat. We define the properties of a cat class. We have getters and setters. We also write uh, a mapping file. We define the package. We mapping the class cat to the table cat. We also registered the mapping file in our Hibernate config file create a new class called dog. To make it simple, I'm going to copy cat. Now we have our new class dog. To do the annotation, it's very simple. You define the entity class. We need to import the package Java X persistent. Okay. We also need to define the ID for our table dog. Add ID import. Java X persistent. Okay. Now we finish the annotation. Then we need to register our entity class in Hibernate config file. This time I'm going to use OK, now the configure file is ready. Create a dog test class. I'm going to copy cat test paste. Dog test. We're going to change cat to dog. We're going to change tone to yellow dog. OK, we have a dog test class ready. Before we do the test, let's look at our database. Open your MySQL. Put news We can see in our database, we only have one table, cat. Let's start our test. Right click, run as Java application. It seems everything works. Let's Check our database. Show tables. We can see the dog table. And also, we see the yellow dog, Jerry. We successfully add data to our database through Hibernate 
GPA annotations. Thank you for watching. See you next time.